Hello everyone. So today we are going to discuss a clear method in our singly linked list implementation. Uh, this is our last video on a singly linked list implementation. So the format is same. First we will do the coding together and then after that uh, I will come back and we will discuss some use cases on a whiteboard. Um, clear. So now there are multiple ways to implement this method. Uh, for example, we are not going to re reuse our existing implementation. In that case, always remember we need to do size equal to zero at some point or maybe size minus minus somehow. Second, what we can do, we have a head so we can remove one by one until head is not null or head is equal to equal to tail something like around that but I, I i prefer to go first check our existing methods if they can help and then later we will discuss how we can implement more optimized way so if you guys remember in last video we implemented remove at method just like you can see here i think we can use this also to to clear how i can use this method so if if i say while is empty not remove at zero so i think uh, we are done uh, clear method is implemented how so so in this case what will happen it will run and it will always come here zero if zero is working properly uh, like zero is a valid input it will go it will check remove first then remove first every time and it means we are moving into the remove first so we can see what is our remove first remove first is this method so every time it will come it will check okay if it's not empty do size minus one one and change the head and then also change everything properly and also if you see we are taking care of properly our tail and head so in this case once all of the nodes are deleted it is empty will be true here and then tail is also null and head is automatically null so we are good uh, then we can also use remove last in some way so if i say remove last so in case of remove last there is no need so every time it will call remove last method in this case we will see okay if head is not null cool no then do size minus minus and call the get node this get node is a call which we implemented some videos ago it's going inside so again it will work but now what we can see get node is big of kind of n because index is always the last one somehow so not good if we go with remove first in this case what will happen remove first is always go and then check if it's not empty delete so it's a big of one operation which is good and then we have a while loop which is a big of n operation n is a number of nodes in a, a linked list so by doing this we can implement so we can run and then we will see what will happen so i can duplicate and then call list dot clear so yeah in the end once we implemented list it's saying okay there is null we can improve this method yes we can so if you see uh, it's a big o of n if i say okay size should be equal to zero head is equal to null tail is equal to null <coughs> in this case we have a big o of one clear operation and i think still the answer will be same only i need to check one more thing any other initializations we are doing so we have a class level operation head tail size and everything else is a method so yes so we can try to run this so it's still null so in this case basically what happened 
वंस आई सेड ओके हेड इक्वल टू नल टेल इक्वल टू नल साइज इक्वल टू जीरो वी आर नाउ सेंग टू द गार्बेज कलेक्शन प्लीज कोलेक्ट द लिस्ट इंस्टेड आई वी विल डिस्कस दैट ऑन द वाइट बोर्ड दैट विल बी मोर गुड लास्ट टाइम वट वी कैन डू आई कैन ट्राई टू कॉल अगेन नो नी टू रिमूव टू कन्फर्म एवरीथिंग इज वर्किंग परफेक्टली then again add these then print then again do this so in this input so we added again node until 10 then do clear then again so values looks good too okay welcome back so we are going to discuss some use cases just like you remember we implemented clear method with different approaches uh, the first approach you can go on your own you will take care of each and everything size minus minus head is going to null while the other approach is we use the in the built in methods which we implemented like remove first remove last i'm not going to discuss those uh, the we will discuss only the maybe last two approaches one is a remove first approach which we used in which we will see what is the uh big of this method and then the last the optimized one so assume we have this linked list where we have these one two three i think three are now okay maybe four so this is our linked list we have our head which is here and we have our tail which is this and we have our size which is currently 5 okay so the first pro uh, that the approach in which i used while loop is not empty and then remove first every time so if you guys remember how we implemented remove first we always come we will always check size minus minus so currently we have size equal to 5 first row is set is empty is empty under the the implementation if you remember size equal to equal to 0 so it means it's false and we have a not it's true while we'll run in that case we are saying remove first remove first what that will do that always take this head to the next value and then uh, remove this by using temp but for now i'm not removing so i will i will use again but now this is not here then one by one it will move until this and then we will we will get in the end the clear linked list and this one that the value and the 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 time complexity will be big of n and here n is a number of nodes available in the linked list and there is no we are not using any extra space so uh, it's it's like the same big of uh, one what we have we are using the same thing now the the optimized approach which we use later in that case what we did we are saying okay clear first go and then change size equal to 0 okay by the way this our singly linked list will not take care of the concurrent uh, modifications we already discussed in the different video so yeah because in that case this implementation will not work so in case of a synchronized uh, Uh, properly used in, in like like a single threaded in that case what will happen we did size equal to 0 then we are saying okay head change to null which means we now remove this connection then we took tail and we move to null and we remove this connection now i'm not very good with the garbage collector gc how that work but uh, i know a little bit about how it works so for example now garbage garbage collector uh, collector is invoked by the jvm runtime in that case what will happen so basically jvm basically check, the, the garbage collector always check the reference so if there is no ref reference it will take that value and it will remove that from the memory and then that that chunk of a memory is available to allocate so for example gc started i'm assuming it took this object and it it passed it 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 try to scan this okay is this 
as a reference so this will not be removed okay then somehow in the end gcr here so gc check this is this object is referenced by anything from the program any other object and there is no reference it means gc will say okay this object can be garbage collected once this one is garbage collected the whole series of this will be collected 